Welcome back, lovely souls. I have a beautiful message for you leaders out there today. If you a leader, hit that like button right now. You heard. If you are a leader, hit it, okay? I also have a beautiful channeled message that I want to present to you today, you lovely soul. I feel like I'm supposed to say thank you so much for standing in your leadership role. You may have felt like life wasn't good to you, but now you're starting to see what is done to you. All of that stuff, it was a challenge when you was in it. But when you got out of it, you started to win. I do want to say that stay tuned to the end because I got a, I'm going to pull a card for guided for you all. And it's from a raising your vibration deck that can give you some more clarity. And I heard a peace of mind and a message that you can take with you. And I'm hearing that it's going to be power packed with information that has been trying to make its way to you. Maybe you have been missing this message and, and, and it's coming through for you today, okay? But before we get up into it, let me tell you this. This came through just now. Not everyone has what it takes to be a great leader, but you do. It's written in the stars for you since the day you were born. You were born with this inside of you. You are gifted and talented and you are finding your way back to you. You had to be lost in order to go looking for the true you. That is such a beautiful message that came through for you. Welcome to the channel, lovely souls. I miss Kelly Travel spiritually, and I'm so grateful to have you here. Your angels, they want you to know that you're not alone and you are constantly guided and supported by the divine energy. And you have strong instincts and you can trust your own intuition. By doing this, it will lead you to stability in your life. You were born to lead. It is a part of your destiny. It is who you are. You feel it. You feel it so deep down in your gut. You know this is meant to be. And we are encouraging you to take on more responsibility and leadership in your life. Discover your hidden talents and bloom into the person you were meant to be. I'm hearing this doesn't happen. I, I, that's just what exactly what I'm hearing. Like, this doesn't happen overnight. But just know that you are doing things right. The potential within you is greater than you may even realize. Your angels are with you every step of the way. If you only ask. You are mature, responsible, a hard worker, filled with determination. And you have this ability within you to grow naturally and to take action when you stay out of your own way. Positive energy from the universe is coming your way. Stay open up and stay true to you. Your hard work and perseverance will pay off one day. And when it does, when it eventually does, you will find success and you will live your best life. And we encourage you to embrace your individuality so you may experience personal growth and satisfaction in your everyday life. You are unique for a reason. And your amazing energy is needed in this world. And for some of you, you are already showing up in this energy and doing the work and putting more light in this world. More light is in your light and it's shining through you. I'm seeing a globe of light, a globe of light. Man, you shining bright. Whatever you are currently doing is aligned with your true purpose in life. You might have been questioning that. You're right. And this will lead you toward a better future for yourself, as well as those around you who need help and guidance along their path. Now is the time for you to start moving forward in your life again. You're not alone. Stay positive and open-minded and use your discernment. Weigh it up. Don't let challenges hinder you from achieving your goals. One day you'll be looking for those challenges because you know it helps you grow. When you're met with difficulties and challenges, remember only one thing matters the most, and that is how you respond to them. Instead, there's a better way of doing this. 
Remain calm and focused despite the challenges that come your way. And you will move through this stuff each and every day. Let me pull one card for you. You lovely soul, you are here to lead. Lead by example, by leading your own life. It all starts with you. All the answers lie within you. You are filled with so much potential, whether you know it or not. One card, one card spirit. What do you want to tell these lovely souls today? What do they need to know most right now? What do they need to know most right now? So what you all need to know most right now is I lovingly accept myself. You see, embrace your individuality. You see that green? That's that heart chakra vibe going on right there. Oh, wow. I just got to show you this. You are divine faucet of the universe. Yes, you are. Yes, you are lovely soul. Yes, you are. And you, oh, hold up. You are safe here. You are protected and always make sure you protect yourself. As it mentioned in this video, discernment. Let me give you a deeper message on what this is about because I feel that many of you have been looking for this and you were supposed to hear, you are supposed to hear this. That's why you're here right now. I lovingly accept myself. Wow. Embrace your individuality, lovely souls. This is connected to receiving. This is connected, look, to the heart. This is connected to your heart. That's why I felt heart chakra vibes is green. That's how you receive. Open up that heart, baby. Let me give you this card is connected to receiving, and it is the heart chakra connected to your heart chakra. So energetically, it, it governs our ability to love, be loved, and give and receive. And on an elemental level, it is governed by the element of air. So it represents the realm of the unseen, that which can only be felt. The heart cards are about opening the gateway of the heart and creating a clear pathway to give and receive. That message was also on, on here today where we mentioned have, following that clear pathway. They're about creating space by releasing any blockages that are standing between us and love. On a vibrational level, these cards are about unfurling our petals and revealing the beauty of our truest, most loving self to the world. Come out your shallow and open up and be seen, lovely soul. Be you. Authentically be you. Let me give you some more information so you can take it with you. Loving yourself can be one of the greatest challenges to overcome. But not for the soul. Not for your soul. For your, it's for your ego. The ego is, is challenging to, to love thyself. But not your soul. The reason self-acceptance can be so hard is because your ego will try to make your love conditional. You will love yourself when your body is perfect or when you finish the project you are working on and so on. But love is unconditional. It goes beyond boundaries, achievements, and vanity. Loving yourself is about being willing to see the great spark of light and goodness in the depth of your being. It's about being willing to respect the, that the body you are in is a miraculous vehicle in which you are able to experience the brightness of your soul. Lovingly accepting yourself means truly honoring who you are. It's about moving beyond the self-perceived flaws and finding the beauty anyway. It's deciding you are no longer going to be represented by negative opinion, fear, or anything else that comes between you and your goodness in the past. Love is who you are. Today, the universe is inviting you to recognize this truth. Your vibe today is I am love, head to toe, body to soul. That is your affirmation. I am love, head to toe, body to soul. It is time to love you as you are unconditionally. Not when this happened, not when that comes, not when you see this. Accept all of you as you are right now, lovely soul, and open up your heart to receive. There's so many great things ahead of your way. And you are an amazing leader, and we thank you for being here. But leading is going to be about being unique and being and embracing your individuality and open up your heart, lovely soul, opening up that heart. I also encourage you, if you may be struggling with this, to eat more green, to research more on the heart chakra, as well as wear more green, and really start to love and hug on you. Tell yourself every day how much you love yourself. How proud you are, no matter how small the bigger things you make it through. Every day, get up and hug on you and love you as you would tell someone else, give it to yourself, lovely soul. Love you. Give it to yourself every day, and I promise you good things will start to change for you. You will start to love yourself. It is a practice. 
and it's a challenge for the ego but not for the soul hit that like button if you feel in this video hit that like button if this message is resonating to you hit that like button if you are a leader you know you were born to lead and you feel it in your gut share this video so we can get this video out to more lovely powerful leaders like yourself share this video and follow me on instagram at miss kelly travel spirit if you have not subscribed to the channel don't forget to hit the subscribe subscribe button and the bell if you found messages here if you feel in love here if, if you feeling inspired or motivated if you feel the vibe hit that subscribe button and bell so you get all the newest videos that i drop take care of you love on you and come back to see me though peace love and light to you